Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. My name is Lorena. I do mommy lifestyle and beauty videos. Today is going to be a little bit more mommy and Christmas. So I'm going to be showing you what I bought for my toddler for Christmas. Um, some of it is more Montessori focused because I am trying to have a more Montessori friendly environment for my son. I plan to send him to a Montessori preschool in, you know, a year and a half when he's able to go to preschool. But um, there's not that many options here um, on Oahu. So we'll see. But I know that so much of what I do at home is really, really important. Even when he does go to school, being that support system at home to support the teachers in the classroom is extremely crucial. So I want to do everything that I can to kind of set him up for a successful future, successful learning and stuff like that. So I wanted to make sure that his gifts were fun, some stuff that he needs, but then also things that he can use for years to come. So I'm very excited about it. So something I experienced uh, throughout my childhood that I discussed with my husband before we even got married and had kids that I want to do with my children is that I don't want to buy my children iPads, electronics, whatever they use now. Back in the day it was iPods and CD players and stuff like that but um I don't want to buy Noah those kinds of things for Christmas or for his birthday I want him to either work for that item or save money because I want him to know the value of uh, items and then the value of money so of course he's young now he doesn't need those things now but if when he gets older and he says mom I want an iPad or a this or a that we'll come to a decision on how he will earn that thing whether it be helping you know me with things or I don't know if we'll map depending on how old he is you know if he's, if he's still like six then he's not gonna be able to save $500 for an iPad or whatever it may be you know so maybe he'll do he'll save or earn money somehow and then my husband and I will match it or whatever it is but anyways my point is that we don't believe in buying electronics for our children for holidays and birthdays and stuff like that um, so you will not see any of that stuff here granted my son is only one and a half he's almost two um, but I do know children that young who have their own iPads and stuff but anyways let's just get on into it so I'm gonna start with these I don't I didn't even open it yet because I want to do some kind of unboxing this is not necessarily for it's for Noah, but it's not necessarily for him to open on Christmas, but I did just want to show it to you. Um, I got these gather mats. So I got two micro size mats and one is the small rainbow and one is the star. And I'm so excited. This is the, the rainbow print. And then... And then that's the little star print in there. I've wanted these gather mats for so long, but I just never could get myself to spend the money on them. But I don't think these micro mats were out when I first had Noah because I think I would have spent $25, $28 on these back then. But I've always wanted these bigger mats and I bought this during the sale and this is the midi circle. So I actually always wanted the rectangle ones, but this circle one was really cute. And this is the shade, um, shade. This is the color in fog. And I think it's really cute. So this is great for a play mat, for the beach, for the park, um, anything like that. So I'm very excited about these. Let's get into what I bought specifically for Noah. So I bought these board shorts from, I think I got this from Sweet Sweet Honey, their website, but then on the tag it says Modern Cakey. I wanted to try to support local or support small businesses so for all the kids in my life I think I got them local clothes and I tried to do local toys but I personally could not find a bunch of local toys um, so I just went with small businesses instead so this next one is the mushy stacking tower I'm not gonna open this because it's brand new and I want Noah to open it on Christmas but it's this one in I think this is like the original shade you can see all the other colors in there but it's so cute so you can stack these obviously like they are stacked now or you can stack it the other way 
and then it becomes like a tower like that and then on the bottom of each of the cups it has different like holes or like pukas in them so some of it is like star shaped some of it is hearts or whatever it is so you can do multiple things with it you can you know scoop water and then see the water fall through or you can use the cup upside down and stick a flashlight through it and you can see the pattern on the wall so you can use this in many different ways okay these two are not from small shops i just saw them at target and this is actually um a paint your own dreidel set this was in like the hanukkah section um and although we don't celebrate hanukkah in particular these dreidels are kind of like tops and we've and i hope this is not offensive if it's offensive in any way please let me know because i'm not trying to be offensive but um noah likes to spin things and my dad's been trying to find him like tops to spin but we i don't think anyone uses tops anymore so i saw this and i figured it would be a good way for noah to practice um his fine motor skills and learn to spin this and then we can also teach him about a different holiday that we don't personally celebrate but it's great for him to know and learn about and know other people's traditions and cultures even though we don't celebrate those in particular so i thought it was a good way to introduce another culture another tradition holiday to him while also allowing him to learn um like more fine motor skills and you know in something that he's interested in in like spinning things so i got this um at target for three dollars and then i also saw this this is also three dollars so it's a puzzle like obviously you can take these pieces out and then put it back you know into the places that it belongs but then you can also take it out and make it a 3d puzzle like you know you can construct it and put whatever arms and legs in what place and then this is kind of like a screw like you just stick it through and then it becomes a little 3d bear so i got this for him and this is something that he can use for years to come and then i got him this book this is the one two threes of thankfulness it's great because he loves books and right now with his age we like these wooden books uh they're a little bit more durable especially because we like to bring them in the car so he can kind of look and read the books while we're driving because sometimes he gets bored so i figured this is a great way to talk about gratefulness thankfulness and then also talk about the uh, numbers so I got this for him and then this okay so this is actually <laughs> this next one is for Noah but it's actually gonna be for my mom but I had it here I ordered it for her and then I I'm gonna have to give it to her but I just wanted to include this because this is so simple but it's actually something I'm really excited for for Noah um, and it's blocks so it's just wooden blocks I think it's 24 or it's like 18 blocks and they're all wooden blocks and again it's so great for children to see something being built up and then you know you can say the word up so they know that this is up and then when they knock it down they see everything come tumbling down and they know that's their direction of down so i'm very excited for noah to get these blocks because he actually doesn't have blocks like he's never had blocks as a baby or a toddler so i'm excited for this and then it goes hand in hand with that kind of because it's from the same place um i ordered that those blocks from banner toys i believe that's like one of my new favorite small shops because they sell all these wooden toys and their shipping is so quick like so so quick i'm pretty sure i ordered that on like monday or maybe even tuesday and i got it by friday which I don't even know how that works, but it, I was very excited about it. So the next thing, this is for Noah from Tommy and I. But you know what? We don't know what we're going to do in regards to like, oh, this is from Santa. Because I feel like he's, he's so young. We're like, we don't have to do that. Like if all the gifts are from mom and dad, that's fine. I don't know. Like, I don't, I don't know how I'm going to navigate that. I don't know how I'm gonna navigate that. But anyways, the next little toy I got for Noah are these golf clubs and these are, I don't need putting clubs, putting, whatever they're called. Um, but these are wooden putters, basically. It also comes with two little golf balls. And then this, 
kind of like a goal basically a goal where you can like you know hit the golf balls through and then there's this one where you can put it you know next to it and you have to make balls go through both of them or just one of them you can do all sorts of things and then in this limited it's actually apparently like they don't sell it usually but they brought it back for like cyber monday or something like that so i picked it up so i figured that this is a cute little toy for him to get and i'm all about the wooden toys and i'm all about toys that he can use for years and years and years i'm not the biggest fan of getting a toy where it can only serve him for a few months until he's over it i think open-ended toys or toys that can last through his you know early childhood years but then even be hand-me-downs for his siblings or his cousins or my friends or whatever it is i'm all about that life so i bought noah these like traditional white crocs i don't does it look pink in that photo oh there you go it's white and then i got him this pin or whatever this anna pin because he loves anna and then I got him this Snoopy pin because he has this little Snoopy doll that he loves. So I got, I don't know if they're called pins, but you know what I mean? Like they attach to the croc, the um, little holes in the croc. So I got him a Snoopy one and I got him, him an Anna one. So I'm very excited about that. That is shipping now, you know, and it should get here. Anyways, whatever. I got him those Crocs. And then last thing is the actually the first thing that I bought. I've wanted this since Noah was born. It didn't obviously make sense to get it when he was born. So I feel like now is kind of the perfect time to get it. And again, this is something that he can use for years and years and years. And then hopefully we will pass it down to his sibling when the time comes. And then even from there, possibly you know pass it on to someone else that we think would like it so it is this wobble board so you can put it like this on the ground and he can sit in it right he can balance he can slide his cars make the cars go flying he can roll his ball off of it um or you can flip it around this way he can you know walk on it practice balancing um again he can do roll his cars and his balls on them you can even put it on the bed and i don't know slide down it of course he's going to be supervised when all of this stuff happens but this is so versatile and i didn't get this earlier because the original one i was looking at was really expensive it was like almost two hundred dollars and then shipping but what ended up working out was that that one didn't ship to hawaii <laughs> it didn't ship to the u.s at all so i ended up just googling it and then i believe i found this one on amazon and i think it was like less than 70 dollars which to me was a steal because all the ones i was looking at were over a hundred dollars maybe even two hundred dollars so i'm very excited about this he can use this for so long i feel like even as i was an older child i loved climbing things and doing all kinds of stuff so i think he'll really enjoy this and i'm very curious to see how he's going to use it because you know i my adult brain thinks he's going to use it in certain ways but his child brain might find more creative ways to use this so i'm very excited about it and this can hold up to like 300 something pounds so noah and i can actually be on here together and i'm yeah tommy and noah can be on here together i don't think tommy and i can be on here together but um we can play on this with noah you know we can do a little what is it, like seesaw moment so i am so excited about this a tradition that we are starting this year i wish i started it last year when he was you know born but he was so young but i always said that when i had kids i'm gonna have them donate during christmas time i'm gonna have them choose a charity or an organization to donate to and they can choose it themselves so whether they want to donate to the humane society or saint jude's or whatever it is they can choose an organization and we will donate money so i can teach them that even though this is a time where yeah we do receive gifts and we do get a lot of stuff and we should be very grateful for it we also need to give back and help those who may not get as much as we do because we are very blessed and we need to acknowledge it's not bad to be blessed and it's not bad to you know have all these gifts but we need to acknowledge our privilege and we need to acknowledge how blessed we are 
and um, give back to others as well. So this year, of course, he can't like exactly say, mom, I want to donate to this charity. Um, but I think I'm going to pick like three, two or three different organizations and then ask him, you know, do you want to help the animals? Do you want to help the kids? or whatever you know the environment the ocean or whatever it is and then he can pick and then we'll donate in his name to that charity and then do that every year um with him Alrighty, so that is going to be it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it um again this is not to say oh my gosh look at all the great things we got for noah um it's not to compare or anything like that i just wanted to show you what i got for my son this is not so much a gift guide because i didn't think that you guys needed a gift guide so close to christmas so yeah i mean you can use this as a gift guide if you want to but um yeah this is what i got for my son and i am very excited i hope he likes it <laughs> i hope he likes it um but yeah I hope you liked it. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Don't forget to head to my Instagram to see the giveaways happening. The giveaway was still happening over the weekend, even though I was not posting vlogs. So be sure to go follow me on Instagram. I'll put it right here and I'll link it down below. But don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on post notifications. It's that bell right next to the subscribe button. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Love you. Bye.